communities. <laughs> well, community leaders are taking the, uh, taking the lead in the homeless problem in the Wabash Valley. Earlier this year, Knox County held a homeless summit. That summit gathered ideas to help fight the homeless problem. News 10 Bureau Chief Gary Bryan tells us how a meeting today brought the community together as one voice. Many people from different organizations here in Knox County met today here at Helping His Hands. The goal was to help fight homelessness here in the county. It was a packed house at Helping His Hands Tuesday morning. Many leaders in the community wanting to help fight homelessness. One of those was Assistant Police Chief Terry Johnson. Homelessness in Vincennes is a problem. It's uh, kind of hard to gauge how much of a problem it is, but I know being Law enforcement for 25 years, I, I've experienced, uh, I've dealt with homeless folks before. Johnson says for his department and other first responders, the first step is to get folks help. Typically, we do try to help them, whether it's to reach out to their friends and family, try to get them a place to stay, or try to refer them to some kind of uh, program. Knox County's homeless problem is a complex issue. One of the main problems is that the issue is not very visible. A lot of that is hidden because it's oftentimes people what we call couch surfing and moving between different locations. Um, and so I think that awareness of the problem is a big key of what we want to do. Each group on hand has their own unique relationship with the community. Mark Hill with the United Way hopes bringing them together will help people out before they hit the streets. We'll need a central point of entry, someplace that they can call where they know what the next step is, what, what a client, what a family, what an individual can do when they experience uh, symptoms uh, from the homeless problem. Now we've put more resources for the homeless on our website at WTHITV.com. Just click on this story. In Knox County, Gary Bryan, News 10.